prison in a cage with invisible walls The wicked zeitgeist of life making grown men crawl On their knees begging please save us from the boogeymen Funded by the CIA funneled through Arabian banks Like a shank to the neck They hit you from the back, no sweat Ho check and watch it shake And take away your freedom, you really don't need them When you're tucked away safe and protected by FEMA Then you must be a dreamer like the great pretender Ask the second amendment why I'll never surrender But I'll never plead a fifth when it comes to September I'ma yell it from the roof and expose the agenda It's time to wake up and open your eyes to the matrix This is going out to the troopers and patriots Living free and dying hard, speaking through battle scars An army of one becomes a global resistance Time to wake up and open your eyes to the matrix This is going out to the patriots Over here, I uh, thought you might want to take a look at this And see how long Well, it's even longer than this, but I mean this is how long honorable people have known that the country was in trouble. United States Congressional Record, March 17th, 1993. The Honorable Representative James Trafficant, Jr., Ohio, addressing the House. We are here now in Chapter 11. Uh, pretty much ends it right there. <laughs> What the fuck? 1993, third chapter 11. Members of Congress are official trustees presiding over the greatest reorganization of any bankrupt entity in the world history. We are setting forth, hopefully, a blueprint for our future. There are some who say it's a coroner's report that will lead to our demise. There's a name. I mean, look at this here. 1929 Zero Stock Market Crash Six point two trillion in two thousand and two. We're at nineteen trillion. So come on, boys and girls. How much did uh George Bush and Barack Obama spend? And Barack Obama has spent more money. He's put this country further into debt. Gained more debt than any other president combined. What a fucking slimer, man. Raising the debt ceiling, don't raise the debt. Then what the fuck are you putting the bill up there for? <laughs> He's done so much of that too. I can't tell you how many times I have said to myself, then what are you signing the damn bill for? <laughs> He's like, yeah, we're not going to use this one. Yeah, don't worry about it, though. We're not going to do anything with it. But what the fuck are you signing it for? Hello? I love flags. So I was going through some flags today. And, um... Came across one I didn't know. Star Trek Next Generation flag. And while looking at that... I noticed this one. I was like, well, it's a pretty interesting flag. And uh, it didn't have a name on it. It just said, alien flag. True. I searched the image. Went to look it up, see what the fuck it is. Wicca. And that's just what it is. Alien flag. It's got no description. It's got no name. I guess somebody just made it or something. But, while checking that out, came across this. Is this the one? Yeah, this is the one. Maps. I gotta remember where I went here. All right.
right there. Yeah, New World Order map game. So you go ahead and click on that. And it gives you the description, you know, the war just ended in 1945. And it's saying that the United States and Russia are the two superpowers. They split the world in half. So basically go and pick your countries. <laughs> It's crazy. I ain't, I haven't tried it yet. But uh, every turn is 24 hours long. I don't. Yeah, who's gonna live up to that one? So here's all the uh, the rules and stuff like that they got. And it sounds like a pretty cool game. But it also sounds like a very true game. Yeah, it's pretty creepy when you, when you go through and look at it. Anyways, we're over here at JesusIsSavior.com. And there's all sorts of crazy stuff on here that you'll come across. This is a good one. End of the world. Um, yeah, I probably won't do much talking on here because uh, the page speaks for itself. Some of the stuff they got on here is crazy. I was going to check some out and I forgot it. Ah, uh, oh, yes, the abortion shit. Yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, all this shit over here that it talks about that's incredible prophecy you might want to go and read that find out how I know so much <laughs> artificial intelligence may force humans to become cyborgs to save lives and prevent death uh, duh I mean free organs and shit uh, until you see when they start doing uh, mobile execution vans like they got in China just pull you right off the street and snip your fucking liver out with a pair of bolt cutters nah no anesthetic throw you back out on the street liverless it sounds like it's all in good fun this ain't shit I laughed when I saw that cause that's like that's old Fucking old news. 13,000 miles an hour. Folks, they got craft that they designed, the government, that can go six, that can make right angle turns at 16,000 miles an hour. That's our technology. Well, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say that, but you know what I mean. Damn, Skippy, Jesus, our soon coming king. Weapons of total destruction. Might want to check that one out. Justice denied. That's fucked up, bug. Okay, so. Some of you might like this music one. The devil's music. <laughs> 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 Demonic Led Zeppelin. They got it all here. Justin Bieber, Kanye West, Dolly Parton, Bruce Springsteen. Damn, everybody. Take your kids there. Go have a gander. Stay the fuck away from that crap. There's a lot of musicians that I have not listened to in years. Jay Z. I used to love Jay Z. I mean, I ain't gonna lie, dude's got the best beats out there, probably. And, dude's nice, but, yeah, when I heard about that, cut off immediately. Cold Turkey. I haven't listened to him in like four and a half years. I'm about to, like, put all that 
I'm about to stop that though. It's just it's stupid. Wanna hear fucking good music? Hear good music. Cause they sure ain't fucking got it out right now. So there is music, police state, I mean you name it Illuminati bankruptcy, divorce. Yeah, divorce is sin. Bohemian Grove. Prison Planet and InfoWars. How to go to heaven. Evil public schools. Soul winning. Feminism. There you go, ladies. War on drugs. How about this one? Television. For all the people who think that I'm kidding about predictive programming and that they actually fucking use television to get their messages across. And to tell their opponents what they've done. To see the opponents know about all this shit. It fucking... Yeah, it goes on and on. I gotta find this other one. Uh, folks, this one here, abortion murder, that is real fucked up. Not for this squeamish at heart. I'm not even going to click on the fucking thing. Very bad. You tell me how a fucking five, a five month old fights a scalpel and tell me that the baby's not born until it comes out of the pussy. Baby's alive well before nine months. Obviously. I mean, what the fuck does a, a five-month-old just out of the fucking stomach know about dangers and shit and just instinctively puts its fucking hands out to the fucking scalpel? People, that is just fucking evil shit. Here, well, here you go. American Holocaust. So you got Planned Parenthood and the pregnancy shit. Then there's a uh, black genocide. Uh, fucking 53 million black babies. Gone. Um, and I, I believe the total, all people, um, there should be about an extra two and a half billion people on the planet right now. Let's put it that way. So yeah, blackgenocide.org. Site just like this. I highly suggest you come on and check this site out. I'll leave it in the description. And you guys can have fun with it. Okay. So for now, God bless and carry on.